I'm just going to make a duplicate of the same image so that we have one original one I can keep going back to. The action that Chris has given everybody that buys the class. So I'm sorry, they loaded all my actions over here, so I'm now trying to figure out the order. And if, is this the right one? I think it is. So uh, the one she is giving you guys is dream. You can see there's a ton of actions in there. I'm not sure. I haven't counted them, but there must be like 25. They do all different. She has, and I'll show you a couple of them, but this is the one that she's given everybody. It's called dream. And it's a great gradient. So the, the, the cool thing about this, I do this a lot in photos that I like to play with that are a little more editorial, uh, putting this gradient color splash. You saw it on her images when we had them pulled up. The good thing about this is when you click on this, that box, you can go into the actual gradient and you can tone that, take that down a bit. So see how it's not covering as much of the image. You can also um, play with this and if you want it coming in from a different part of the photo or if you want it. So this photo has a lot of white at the, you know, the top and the side. So I would probably want to come in more from a side and not cover as much as of her. But I, I, I like to play with uh, these kind of gradients. And she has a couple of different ones that is in there. But this is the one that she's given everybody for free. And I'm going to go ahead. And the other thing is, too, you can just lower. Like, if you feel like it's too overwhelming on your image, just take it down a notch, and it might just give you a nice little soft soft feel. But she has, I wish I had to memorize better. She, um, I just started playing with them last week. Let me see if I can show you. Windswept, maybe. Oh, maybe I don't have this one running right. But like, see how it's even broken down into layers once you do that drop down. So you can you can play with each of these things and adjust the colors a little bit. Um, she has sorry, I'm going crazy on my little mouse thing. Just ad adjusting the opacity. I, you saw them used. See, and that's what I was talking about with style of photography. There's some of these that work well with mine. But I feel like when you saw hers, like she would use that same action, and it just like her style and how it works. And then I have like all of these look beautiful on hers. And then I had like five that I was like, oh, I would totally use those ones just because they, they worked with my style so well.